first, fast, accurate. You're watching WSBT 22 News at 530. A visitation for Father Theodore Hesburgh is going on right now at the Basilica on the Notre Dame campus. People from around the area and around the world are remembering the former Notre Dame president who helped shape minds and make changes. The funeral and a public tribute are by ticket only. WSBT 22's Annie Chang is live at the Joyce Center where the university handed out tickets for Father Hesburgh's memorial service. Annie, you talked to some of the very first people in line for those tickets. They did, Jennifer. They waited in line for more than an hour to be able to attend that service tomorrow, and each one had a story about Father Hesburgh to share today. The limit is two. Yeah, two for me. Let me show you my card. Okay. The Joy Center box office began handing out tickets to the general public at 3 p.m., but Marianne Angieski showed up promptly at 2. She didn't go to Notre Dame, but living in South Bend, she saw Father Ted transform the school into a world-renowned university. He brought Notre Dame prominence, and people realized we were more than just a little college. Al Harding was first in line. The Irish alum graduated in 1984 when Hesburgh was still university president. He's a legend and he's a, he's a part of me and so that's why I want to be here. Harding's two kids now attend Notre Dame. He says he sees Father Ted's legacy play out in his life every day. Father Ted's spirit will live on in all of us whenever we do good work. Dan Morrison, second in line today, will never forget the time he picked up a payphone and called Notre Dame president and presidential advisor Theodore Hesburgh. That was before cell phones. I just used the payphone and he answered the phone. He was in the library, you know, in his office there, which is cool. He doesn't remember what they talked about for 20 minutes, only that Father Ted answered. Everybody's got their story about, you know, Father Ted, and that, that's mine right there. And again, that ceremony will be held here at the Joy Center. That's tomorrow evening at 7.30 p.m. Some of those speakers include President Jimmy Carter, First Lady Rosalind, former Secretary of State Condoleezza Rice, and Indiana Senator Joe Donnelly, just to name a few. Of course, we'll have that coverage here on WSBT 22 News. Live from Notre Dame, I'm Annie Chang, WSBT 22 News. Annie, thank you. Visitation for Father Hesburgh continues until 6 o'clock tonight. Then it stops for the public tribute, and visitation begins again at 9. The funeral mass for Father Hesburgh is tomorrow at 2 o'clock at the Basilica. That is also a private event. We have been granted permission to air that mass live here on WSBT 22.